guys i am back for another uh video my hair is in a very very old wash and go i use echo style gel um with the red top and yeah she is on day six um i didn't do anything to maintain it last night which is why it's looking the way it does this is what the back looks like this is what this side looks like so yes, 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 she is dry. She is, girl, there's a, some uh, buildup going on right here. So it is time for wash day. What I've been doing for the past two years or so is I try to detangle my hair the day before wash day. Um, I was exclusively finger detangling, I would say for the first four or five years going natural, then I started using a comb. Um, and then as of last year i started using the wooden comb right now i do a combination of finger detangling and wooden comb but right now what i want to do is get back to finger detangling and possibly using my wooden comb or a comb in general um monthly okay so what i'm going to do is i'm going to use a mixture of aloe vera juice and water in the spray bottle okay then i have a free poo okay um I'm gonna admit, I've been lazy when it comes to detangling. So I need to really, really get into my hair. My hair, you guys, it gets really, really tangled at the roots. The roots are horrible. Um, and then every now and then I get this spider spider web type of, I don't know what you call it. My, my hair almost crisscrosses. Um, I don't know if you'll see an example here because it's in a wash and go, but definitely when I have an old twist out or braid out, you can see an almost crisscross spider web in the middle of my hair. So finger detangling helps with that. So what I'm gonna do is section off my hair and we're gonna get started. Now I do have a pre-poo and like I said, I have been lazy, 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 lazy. So I really need to go in and detangle my hair properly this time. Um, and by lazy, I mean, <coughs> excuse me, I will, apply a pre-poo, lightly, lightly detangle, and then get in the shower and detangle more. I cannot. I know every now and then I see comments on other videos when it comes to detangling. I cannot detangle my hair in the shower. If I got in the shower, it will, I shouldn't say that I cannot. It's a waste of resources. It's a waste of water, a waste of my time. Um, it would take between 35 to 40 minutes in the shower, all that water to detangle my hair in sections, you know, dropping combs and yeah. Outside of the shower, if I'm using a comb combination with finger detangling, hour to hour and a half, finger detangling, two to three hours. I know, I know, but it's because of the density of my hair. So let me hush up and um, I like to do a lot. Okay, um, that was nothing. We're gonna try Thing. Uh, ugh, look at that. It is so dirty, so very dirty. So, want to be gentle. Now, I'm only going to do a front section for you guys and a back section because we we look. We don't have that much time. You don't have that much time. I don't have that much time. Yeah, no, nah, we don't. Okay, let's see. We're gonna do. This is not even the back yet. This is right here. We're getting there, we're getting there. All right. So you can definitely see the different textures of my hair. My hair is looser in the front, which is why it's longer, and then tighter in the back. It's almost, in certain areas in the back, it's almost like a Z. You know what I'm talking about, those of you who are for for BC, but it looks like a Z almost in certain areas. Look at the shrinkage, okay? So, <laughs> uh, yeah, I need to lightly miss that. All right. All right, so now I'm going to, now that I have this section, lightly mist sometimes i like to even put water in my hands like that and what applying water is going to do one it's going to um 
it's gonna almost like activate the gel because you can even see it. And I'm just gonna start separating, okay? So do you see what I'm saying? You probably can't see that. Can y'all see that? How it crisscrosses in some certain areas? Oh, that's a good example. Do you see that? It crisscrosses like a spider web. Which is why Now, um, I try to be careful because I do have fake nails, but honestly, real nails are worse because you can have hang nails and all that. I'm paying, paying close attention to my ends. See how I'm getting all of that out there like that? Yeah. Okay, I'm gonna apply a little bit more water. And at this point, I'm just gonna use a little bit of pre-poo to help. Um, my pre-poo is very similar to nappy-headed jojobas pre-poo, and I do have a video on that. I'm gonna do the praying hands. And I'm gonna add a little bit more at the root. See, I can feel my hair is getting stuck right there, so yeah. section right there that's done okay so now all I'm gonna do is twist that up and move on to the next section so I'm gonna show you guys um, what the front section would look like and now um, I would since there's a pre pull in my hair I would rinse the pre pull out and then immediately shampoo with my hair and twist um, and then today I am doing a deep conditioner. When I do a deep conditioner, I bypass doing a um, conditioner. Hold on, let me zoom out. I'm so sorry. When I deep condition my hair, I feel like there's no need to use a conditioner. I mean, you, it doesn't make any sense. So, all right, so now let's see. We're going to do a front section of my hair. Uh, <laughs> All right. Okay, so let's just do this front section right here. Why not? Why not have edit? Okay. That may be a little too much. Okay. I can feel, I mean, can you see the fallout? I can feel it. So the front section and my sides are not gonna be nearly as cumbersome as my back. And that's why I have a lot of hairs towards the back of my head. So I'm gonna take some of this pre-poo and smooth it down. Okay, you need to stay over there.
And that's it. That is finger detangled right there. And now all I do is twist this up. Pray that God gives me the strength to continue. <laughs> oh my gosh. Yeah, normally I finger detangle and use a wooden comb. And that takes me between 45 minutes to an hour. Yeah, this is going to take some while. Um, I could do it in an hour, but it won't be as detangled as it should. So, yeah, that's it. So, all right, you guys, I just wanted to show you um, what that looks like. And that is it. Thank you so much for watching. Take care. Bye.